According to an unreleased Confidential World Bank report, rising food prices have pushed 100 million people worldwide below the poverty line and have sparked riots from Bangladesh to Haiti. As warning bells began to sound over rising food prices, analysts were quick to name the culprits. Rising oil prices, the weakening US dollar, speculators' droughts and the increasing appetite of developing countries were all blamed for triggering the spike in prices. Although biofuels were often cited as a contributing factor, the US Secretary argued that their impact was tiny. But the World Bank report has enlightened us. Biofuels caused 75% of the rise in food prices from January 2002 to February 2008. The voracious demand for biofuels is largely a consequence of the rich world, trying to ensure its own energy security. The belief in the eco-friendly biofuel car is widespread, but biofuels will actually not help to reduce climate change. They will in fact make life harder for millions of poor people around the world. The bulging consumption of biofuels has resulted in large-scale changes in land use. 138 million tons of corn are burnt just by US cars over one single year. The amount of corn used to fill one single American tank with bioethanol can feed a child for 365 days. Where should we put all the corn? Into the fuel tanks of over 800 million car owners? Or into the hungry mouths of 2 billion starving people?